Hey, welcome to another Empires and Puzzles Books video. Today I want to talk about my Crazy Nature team. You probably heard me talk about this team a couple times. Uh, but I want to go into the mechanics of why I feel like this is almost a perfect team. So, there is Elemental Defense down from Evelyn. Regular Defense down from Frigg, which I always look for in my mono teams. They stack for lots of Defense down. And then we have the Hatter and Elkadin who are big hitters. What makes this team particularly strong is how fast they are. So Evelyn is a fast hero with a level 30 mana troop. So she's at full charge in seven tiles, which can be two matches if I get a, a, a foursome for a dragon coin and then a regular three match. So seven is key here. So she's ready in seven tiles. <clears throat> Frigg has the mana node on her emblems and a level 23 mana troop, so she is ready to go in seven tiles. Skip over the Hatter for a moment. Elkanen has the costume bonus, the mana node, and a level 12 mana troop, so he's ready in seven tiles. Toxicondra is also fast with a 30, so she is also ready in 30 tiles. The Hatter is average with a level 23 mana troop, so he's ready in nine. So as long as I get seven tiles, four-fifths of the team are ready to go. If I get nine tiles, everybody's ready to rock and roll. But what else is really interesting here <clears throat> is we have two ways of addressing enemy buffs. Evelyn cleanses the buffs, and the Hatter steals them. So I have two opportunities to get rid of anything annoying they put on their end. In the current meta, that is super important with the Taunt heroes and the Reflect heroes. And I really like the Hatter to steal those. If there is no Taunt or Reflect hero... I will sometimes substitute Francine in for the Hatter, who is also a fast he hero uh, and does damage equally to three. The Hatter hits one real hard and two soft. Toxicondra, fast healer, which is fantastic, and she also removes uh, ailments, so she helps cleanse the team. The Elkanen, Elkanen does some self-healing, which can be helpful at times. Uh, so overall, it's just a very fast team that's efficient at cleansing and debuffing and hitting hard. So we're going to jump in now and see if we can do a perfect raid chest with this team. So I got a new raid chest at, at zero heroes. So we're going to go in and see if we can do eight wins in a row. And I'm just going to go with the first eight teams that pop up regardless of their makeup. All right, let's jump in and hit Joe Zero for our first target. <clears throat> now, if boards are equitably distributed, there be seven tiles of each color on a board, on a starting board. And that has been, with my math, the average. So, and here we see we got eight greens. We just need to figure out how to line them up. I'm going to take advantage. Ooh, I did that wrong. <laughs> it's going to take advantage of the dragon coin. That would have saved me a match. I just made this harder for myself. We're going to go ahead and see if we can sneak a green in there. And we did, but it made an unfortunate match. Not too worried about getting Toxicondra up. This is one of these teams that has two healers up front, bear in the back, so there's only two people striking that I have to worry about. So I do feel like I got time here to negotiate this board a little bit. Uh, not too worried about minions yet. Let's see if we can sneak a green over there. Getting the tiles, but not exactly where I need them. Let's do it this way. We might need a hit from Roosterly here in a moment. All right, let's hope we don't lose anybody important from the minion fights. All right, so I'm gonna use the Hatter to steal all those good buffs that they just put out. So everything's gonna leave them and come onto my team. And now we're gonna start loading up some hits. So Evelyn, she's gonna hit everybody because of the formation they chose. Frigg always hits everyone. And now we're gonna smack them with the Hatter. Okay. 
I want to do that suggested match, but I really do not want to eat a hit from Onyx at full blast. But I don't even think I have another match that I can do. All right, well, this could be devastating depending on how hard he... And he's going to go up to a third charge. All right. Okay, that wasn't terrible. And he is gone. And now there's not really any threats on the board. All right. So I made that harder for myself by fat fingering that first move and missing the dragon. But that's one down. Uh, and we're starting at global rank 25,000 something. We'll see where we end, if we can do eight wins in a row. So again, I'm not caring about what the defense looks like. I'm just going with the green either way. All right, two, four. Got our seven tiles. Let's see if we can start matching them. get another one to sneak in there. No such luck on that. All right. Well, let's see if we can kill June. He's pretty deep. And we got our seventh tile here. So I'm gonna <coughs> I'm gonna give the elemental defense down to those three, and I'm hoping Frigg will take out Kobold. Perfect. Big shot from Elk. going to be it. Oh, I forgot to mention that not only is this team fast, but Toxicondra also gives a little mana boost at the end of each turn. And that makes it even faster. Alright, 242. Two. Alright, the rock. And you got Gravemaker back there. Viola and Clarissa, so they got a lot of dot damage. So that's going to be important for Toxicandra to be able to cleanse that and get rid of it. Alright, let's go this route. We get a nature tile up there. Perfect. Let's. Are you going to give me a diamond? Look at that. That I don't like. Elkanen hits big, which is why I use him. Get some cleanse in there. We're going to go on this side first since Brady hits nature particularly hard. Alright, so they're imbalanced on health. Viola's hit more than Grave, so I'm going to use the Hatter on him so he hits her with Minor. Hopefully that kills both of them. I can save Elk. Perfect. Alright, got some poison over there. Not too worried about it. And that is this game. So we're going to eat a hit here from Roosterly. And everybody's gone. Three for three. All right. Two, well, four four star heroes and a green diamond to start. I don't think this is going to go well for them. 
Okay. Not, not with that combo. So that was just an unfortunate matchup. All right. Uh, so we have Alina. We'll be able to steal her uh, repost if she gets that out there. And now this is a situation where I'm, you know, two fire tanks up front. But again, with... Uh, With a full mono team, I don't worry too much about being the weak color. All right, we got the four. We just need the three. I'm not too worried about setting people off. Seven tiles and done. And there's the Hatter. Still the repost, but it doesn't really matter at this point because it's so early in this match. <coughs> Alright. So where are we at here? Five wins, three to go. And we are... Up to global 3,000. And this is a perfect team. This is the exact kind of team that I love hitting with this team. Uh, there is no real damage dealer except Gravemaker. Everybody else is support heroes. So I have all the time in the world to get tiles. And if Sif goes off, I will just steal her. I will just steal her three posts. And I just made my foursome match. So now I just need one three. And there is the three. Target Sif already. And this is not going to be any problem. That little mana plus that one tile is going to be enough to get Elk up. Sneak of green. Here goes the header. I actually thought the header would have been enough to kill her. Otherwise, I would have saved him for stealing that repost. But this is why I have the debuffer as well. So Mother North needs to go. She's the only real threat to bring people back. Should bring us to two needed. All right, this team is a bit more dangerous. Thor from the Avengers, tighter setup for sure. Okay. So we got six tiles ready to go. But getting another one is going to be a challenge. Let's see if we can sneak. Here we go. Needed those seven. There they are. So I'm going to kill this side first just because Frig can dodge. All right. Pop this in the center. be enough mana for the header. Oh, look at that. <laughs> oh. 
All right, seven one shots. Can we go for the perfect chest? And uh, well, that's unfortunate for them. Another four star matchup, but we're just trying to show what is possible here, folks. All right, so I am not worried about Krampus. Raid chest. That is why I love this nature team. <laughs> 